Well, is there a more breathtaking occasion in football than a semi-final of a cup competition? When you know that one team is going to advance to the final itself and the other team is going to rather fade away. That's precisely the situation we've got here today. They're down to the last four. Yeah, I know that. I've lost one. And I can tell you no one remembers, including me. But I'll tell you what, they can be these games, real nervy affairs. I often think in a semi-final, the team that controls their nerves best has got a great chance of winning. Key time for Liverpool now, Andy, isn't it, with their new American owners? Uh, the extra revenue that seems to be essential to really push on to uh, uh, deal with the likes of Manchester United and Chelsea. No excuses now is what I would say. They're playing no excuse football. They have the backing financially, they have the crowd, they have the ground. Well, they're getting a new one, of course, which is going to make them even more uh, accessible to success, it seems. But they have no excuse now and they need to be... Fantastic chance! Takes the shot off! And that is the post he's hit, and it's a goal kick. And so far, the game uh, giving us plenty to talk about here. Well, sometimes you get disappointed when you come to watch football matches. Not today. Just reading the direction of the pass as he's done then. Surely he'll score! Foot behind the ball. Here's a chance. And there's the goal. Got the placement really to perfection here. Oh, that was so accurate. Only had about a yard to find, and my goodness, he found it. Well, they've just been caught. Too many men upfield. They've been... This is the chance. Foot behind the ball. He's managed to help his side out there but it wasn't very convincing was it well read to uh, cut that one out oh he's hit the post here i don't know if this kid's nervous but it certainly looked that way that was in a dreadful attempt well i'm really enjoying the action up to this point what do you feel about it yeah i think we're seeing a, a mixed bag mark some good play some scrappy play oh a good chance for a pass there but close range chance and it's a header, and the ball's in, it's a goal! Plunge for the ball, made the contact, and once he'd made contact, Helen, I think it was always going to be a goal. Yeah, he got good power behind it, and he got the accuracy as well, which made the, the keeper's efforts useless, really. Yeah, thanks to a fantastic cross, just dropped beautifully, and he threw... And he has a go here, and he's kept that shots on here, and that is simply sensational. Well, that's the most unlikely of angles, but the ball crosses the line. It's an extraordinary goal. That's football at its best. It was great defending, but the strike was just too good. Liverpool are really on top form in this first half. Well read by the defender. And now can he score? It's a goal! This is the man of the moment, no question about that, with his second goal of the game. Well, they're dominating now, 4-0 on the scoreline. Brilliant opening, and now the shot, and there it is, the goal. It's a day to celebrate, to put a red ring round in the diary, a hat-trick day. Yeah, which don't come around too often, so no wonder he's celebrating with his teammates. Well, they've just been caught, too many men upfield, they've been broken against and they've been punished. Great chance! Well, that's the sort of defending that can win you a match. It was a brilliant challenge in difficult circumstances. Now he's looking for support. Great opportunity, and he, what a goal! And that's a two for him now in the game. And goodness me, he really is on top of his form and on top of the opposition. Well, I can't believe he's taken the shot on. I hope he meant it. Well, he's blown for the free kick, and that might not be the end of the punishment. And the goalkeeper 
opting to hang on. He hangs on well. And there's a good run being made ahead of the ball. Here's a chance to play. Well, the defender panicking there. He just got the ball away. And the time to be added on is just one minute. And a very good piece of blocking here of the shot. And that whistle means it's time for a break. It's half-time. Well, I'd be interested in your thoughts on this, Andy, but I think I can guess them because they're getting rather overrun out there. Well, they're being totally dominated. There's a massive golfing class out there, and the best team is just so far in front, it's ridiculous. The second half here, and we're all ready for it. Aggressive uh, team play here because the man on the ball is being helped by plenty of it. He's got one or two alternatives. Ah, it's a goalkeeper save there, but not a difficult one. And now, good try. And that's a brilliant goal, well taken. Well, it certainly looks as though his first goal has given him the confidence to snatch another. And talk about men against boys, very massively one-sided. And they've got it back through the interception. It's very good skill, he's made it. Oh, he's away, he's clear. And he has a go here. A decent effort, just, just off target. Yeah, unlucky, because uh, he got some power behind the ball, just not the direction. Oh, well, they've lost the ball. And he gets it back again, quickly. Great opportunity. He's had a good swing at that one, and he's taken the chance beautifully. Just out of the goalkeeper's reach. Yeah, just almost passed into the net, didn't he? Well... There's no doubt about the outcome, and that's been the case for a long time now. A couple of options available. Change of play. In a goal, hit it well, and a very good goal indeed. For Liverpool, it is looking pretty much now that the victory is assured. Oh, it's an enviable situation for them. Should be home and host. And talk about men against boys. Very massively one-sided. And there is some uh, backup for him in this position. He can put it into the box now. It's decent attacking play. Good skill with the ball to beat a man. Support coming up on his left here. Great opening. And he could shoot. Taps the ball into the empty net. Scoring again is one thing, but he's flaunting it now. Well, he's never right to be happy, of course, scoring a goal, but he should be careful about rubbing it in a little bit too much. Well, talk about making the most of your opportunities. It's his third goal, and he really deserves the acclaim. Think you might be man of the match? Definitely. <laughs> he came in hard then. But, well, this is some run. And he strikes a goal. I say, what a goal. That's a brilliant goal. Impudent, really, to try and even put the ball in from there. Well, you've got to push him way to the post. He's just pushed that one back out. And the striker's hammered at home. In a goal, and the shot, and it's a good one. Oh, the ball's over the line, and it's a goal! For Liverpool, it is looking pretty much now that the victory is assured. Oh, it's an enviable situation for them. Should be home and host. 
Well, he looks to be carrying an injury, but he's still good enough to score. Here he is with a chance. Did it well. The goal stands. Good goal. Great result. Fantastic performance. That about sums it up. And talk about men against boys. Very massively one-sided. In a goal. He's hit it well. And that is simply sensational. Good goal. Great result. Fantastic performance. That about sums it up. Well, it's a delightful goal. And if I'm honest, there's been a huge gulf between the quality of these two sides today. And the referee blows for one last time. Well, they've won the semi-final and they move on into the final. Great result. Yeah, it's exactly what they were after. A shot at the cup. Oh, it's been a wonderful game. From Andy Gray and myself, Martin Tyler, a very good night to you all.